called Harry Plays in Angry Days. Uh, originally, I had a shop just up the road, which we started about two and a half years ago. And about six months ago, we started talking and we thought, because he was a hairdresser before, obviously, and we were like, oh, we wanted to kind of open a shop which had a bit of everything, really. And it kind of just evolved from there, from a drunken chat into kind of getting everything together, finding the shop. Until the more we talked about it, the more we realised it was something that we had to do, so we just kind of jumped in at both feet. We were just know. trying to do something a bit different as well, and like, yeah, give opportunity people to get their hair cut and look at some nice stuff at the same time, so yeah. It's been a very positive reaction, and it's like a niche retail business like this, and then also having a salon to eat together. It's just kind of, it's just the nice thing with the salon is it always creates like a social atmosphere. It's almost a bit of a social club as well, isn't it? Like, we have, we, so. like we've got the barbecue out in the back, so when the sun's out, we ch chuck some food on the barbecue. Like people come in and just use it, have some food, have a chat, and so uh, yeah, kind of chill out. We stock Acapulco Gold, Benny Gold, uh, Kicks Tokyo, um, quite a lot of like kind of urban streetwear kind of stuff, and obviously night footwear that we get. We get for, uh, we don't get that. We just source that independently from uh, from America and a few other places like that. And uh, yeah, a few other smaller brands that we do. Kui is another one that's like new from LA, but we try and keep all the brands that we do, we try and have it so no one else has got it. The quality of service is definitely kind of sort of the same that you've received in kind of, sort of like any high end salon, but it has kind of adopted that kind of barbershop vibe, but more, yeah. kind of sort of more like a, a unisex barbershop vibe. All the stuff we have in here, you won't find on the high street. It's like a bit more independent, uh, a lot more friendly. People come in, we have a chat for them. Like, especially with like shoes and stuff, we try and uh, order for people if they come in and they want a certain shoe, we try and source it for them. It's things like that, really. So just a bit more of the independent touch. Yeah.